Northwestern University announced this week steps it's taking to combat anti-Semitism and Islamophobia on campus in the wake of pro-Palestinian and counter-protests last spring. All students will be required to take a class on anti-Semitism and other forms of hate when they return to classes in September. Northwestern President Michael Schill says faculty and staff will also undergo mandatory training on anti-Semitism and hate. Schill emphasized there is no room on campus for anti-Semitism. There is no room for Islamophobia. There is no room for racism and other forms of identity-based hate. Northwestern also announced it will unveil its new protest policy next month. One professor arrested during campus demonstrations warns the changes could put students' free speech at risk and says she's seeking guarantees that those rights will be protected. The changes come as universities across the U.S. try to avoid disorder caused by some campus protests. Indiana University now requires 10-day advance notice for encampments and will limit signage and amplified sound, while the University of Denver announced an all-out ban on protest tents. For State Arrow News, I'm Lauren Taylor. For more on the war in Gaza and new campus policies regarding protest, download the Straight Arrow News app or you can visit SAN.com.